What's up, everyone? James Lynch here for Odds Checker US, taking a look at Saturday's UFC 268 main card. And finally, we're back on a regular schedule after last week. This card's going to be taking place at 10 p.m. Eastern Time, uh, 7 p.m. Pacific Time as far as the pay-per-view goes. Prelims a lot earlier than that as well. Uh, we're going to start in the main card here. Really exciting fight in the bantamweight division. We've got Frankie Edgar taking on Marlon Chito Vera. It is Chito Vera who's the favorite in this fight, and understandably so. 28 years old compared to 40 for Frankie Edgar. 5'8 compared to 5'6 and 70.5 inch reach compared to 68 but don't count out Frankie Edgar in this fight as well um, you know he's still competing at a high level yes he was finishing his last fight but Edgar's a guy that uh, can always get it done uh, when you just when you're ready to count him out so to speak so really exciting fight here to kick off the pay-per-view uh, the next fight we got to look at is Shane Burgos and Billy Quarantillo I feel like these fighters are pretty similar um, Shane Burgos a slight favorite here or big favorite I should say at minus 200 uh, he's 30 years old compared to 32 for Billy Q 5 foot 11 compared to 5 foot 10 and a 75 inch reach compared to 70 even outside of all of those stats it's understandable why Burgos is the favorite here he's fought better competition uh, even though he is coming off that loss to Edson Barbosa we'll see if Shane Burgos the Hurricane can bounce back here against Billy Q uh, next fight we got to look at is just a banger this has got to be a fight of the year for sure Justin Gaethje Michael Chandler you see Justin Gaethje a slight favorite here at minus 195 uh, the comeback on Michael Chandler plus 155 uh, Chandler a little bit older at 35 he's 5 foot 8 with a 71.5 inch reach Gaethje is 5'11 so a little bit taller although uh, Chandler will have the reach advantage and uh, Gaethje a little bit younger as well at 32 years old. Uh, Gaethje hasn't fought since that fight against uh, Habib Nurmagomedov a few years back uh, or back in 2019, whereas Chandler just lost his opportunity at winning the lightweight title by getting finished by Charles Oliveira in the second round earlier this year. Uh, the co-main event, we've got Rose Nami Yunus defending her strawweight, whoops, strawweight title against uh, Zhang Wei Li. Uh, these two fought last. They actually fought earlier this year, so they're doing the rematch, and you can see the odds are pretty even. I've seen some books have Zhang as the favorite here. Uh, 29 years old compared to 32. Five foot five to five foot four, 65 to 63. So the current champ, Rose Nami is going to be a slight favor or slight, uh, slight bigger, I should say, in the fight. And uh, Rose has been on quite the roll here, won five of her last six, just the one loss to Jessica Andrade, including the head kick knockout over Weili Zhang. And Zhang suffered her first loss uh, in the UFC in her last fight. Can she bounce back and get it done against Rose Nami Yunus in the co main event? We will have to see. And then, of course, the main event Kamara Usman, Colby Covington. I will be giving my pick for this fight in another video, but uh, really exciting rematch here. Um, Kamara Usman, a big favorite at minus 310 to come back, and Colby Covington plus 240. 34 years old to 33, six feet tall to 5'11, 76 to 72. So Usman going to be a little bit bigger in this fight. Usman's fought three times since their first fight, uh, getting a finish over Jorge Masvidal in his last fight back in April, finishing Gilbert Burns before that, and then defeating Masvidal uh, last year uh, in July. They haven't fought since December of 2019. Since then, Colby's only fought one time. He got a finish win over Tyron Woodley uh, back in uh, September of 2020. So long layoff for Covington heading into this fight. That's likely why he's the underdog and the fact that Usman finished him in their first fight. So make sure you keep an eye out for my breakdown of that fight on this channel as well. So there you have it. I am James Lynch. Thanks so much for watching. Follow me on Twitter and on Instagram at Lynch on Sports. And make sure you subscribe to the Odds Checker US YouTube channel where you will find my breakdowns every single week along with my fighter interviews. Enjoy the fights on Saturday. I'll talk to you soon. And thanks so much for watching.